Well, what we know from science is that when an individual acts with intention, compassionately recognizing the suffering of another and intervenes or desires to intervene, the areas of the brain that are associated with reward uh, actually are stimulated and uh, as well as the pleasure centers. So, um, and then a, a strange thing happens with your peripheral physiology. When you're in this mode of being kind and compassionate, it actually uh, uh, stimulates your vagus nerve, which is this uh, large bundle of neurons that go from your brainstem throughout all the organs in your body. And it's a two-way highway uh, with a lot of um, innervation into the heart. Uh, when you actually engage in compassionate action, uh, your peripheral physiology functions better. Your blood pressure decreases, your heart rate variability increases, your immune system is boosted, the um, production of inflammatory proteins is decreased, and inflammation is associated with the occurrence of, the chronicity of, the severity of, uh, a variety of diseases. Uh, so there's a whole, whole uh, slew of physiologic effects in a positive way when one acts compassionately.